Hey, what's going on, guys? I'm Chris or X Guys, and today I'm gonna show you how to get the step one of the Blood of the Dead Easter egg complete. So there are a couple of prerequisites you are going to need to do before you can actually start this Easter egg, and I'm gonna have a link to the description to some of these guides. Now, if you don't know how to do any of these, there are tons of guides out there for this. The first thing you're gonna need to do before you can start this Easter egg is build the shield. You are also going to need to pick up the Hell's Retriever. You do not have to upgrade it, and then you also are going to need to get the spoon. So Make sure that you know how to do that. You need, again, you need to get the shield, you need to get the spoon, which you can see right here, and then you also need to get the health retriever. So once you have all three of these things complete, we can move on to the actual step one of the Easter egg. So step one, you are going to need to use the shield and get three souls to be able to do a charge attack with the shield. You can use a charge attack by just pulling out the shield and then using the trigger button. And then you're going to need to go up towards Pack-a-Punch and zap it with the spirit blast attack with your shield. This will trigger the beginning of the Easter egg. There is more to this, so this is just what you need to do to actually progress. So once you have Pack-a-Punch built, we are good to go. We're good to do the actual step itself. So with the spoon, you are going to head on over towards the warden's house. And then up on the staircase, if you knife the wallpaper, it will actually like leave marks on the wall. And this is the start of the step itself. You need to have the spoon. You don't have to get the golden spork. The spoon works fine. You just knife that part of the wall. And then from here, you actually need to get to at least round 18. The reason for this is because the Brutuses that spawn in, the Wardens, they only have this electrical charge attack on round 18 plus. So you need to actually bring them up here and hit a charge attack on the wall that we knifed earlier and it will open up the secret area. This is like the Wardens chambers. And then there's a little bit that we can do in here too for step one. So once this is open, you hit it with the charge attack from the Warden. There is a little red cube thing right here, spear. I don't know what that thing is, but you can hold square to pick that thing up. And then you can interact with the electric chair. And you will see like this nice little animation. The electric chair starts floating up and it reveals a little bit of the story. So this is how you complete step one of the Blood of the Dead Easter Egg. I'm going to have guides for this entire Easter Egg coming out towards the channel as soon as possible. There are going to be a bunch of them today. So subscribe if you're new to the channel. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. And until next time, I'll see you guys later with some more Black Ops 4 Zombies. Peace.